And 1 4, Monster of the Ruins. We're in the ruins that old man watch it reminded us of. Mario, I can feel it calling. The pure heart is nearby. Oh wait, I sent something else emanating from the sand dunes. Be careful now, Mario. Something else is waiting for us ahead. What if it's behind us? It's not behind us. And nothing in here. Go through the next door. We don't want to jump into that fire stick thingy. There's, there's got to be something over here. No. He's just gonna walk right into the <laughs> You stupid idiot. Uh, is there anything over here? Yes, there is. And it's a little life shroom. Cool. Oh wow. That was a blind jump if I've seen one. Here we go. Oh. We just go 3D. We also need to pop these blocks, and flip dimensions, and then we go through the door to find presumably the key for that locked door. Uh, can I pick this boy up? I cannot. Dang. Is it the key? It sure is the key. Can we just walk by them? And we walk by this. Maybe. Ruins key. I did it. <sighs> oh no, my battery's low. What am I ever going to do? Probably just throw this boy in the, uh, the sand. And not myself, thank you. Come on, there we go. Dude, I can't get up there. Unless... I'm an absolute gamer. There's gotta be something... up with this. Come on. Uh, okay, nothing here. What if I just walk right by you guys? <laughs> sure, I'll take it. Uh, we have to crawl up here and do the thing, get another key, so much fun, ah, uh, look at that, wait, no other spawns, okay, oh, here we go.
Okay, what was the something that happened outside? Uh... Aha! I see. Need to get out of the sand first. Aha, I see. So we go up here and then we use throw to pick up the key. Big brain. And then we use the ruins key. Easy. Aha, uh -huh, nothing here, except use this, we can use the platform. We need to find another key. Ah, oh, there's something back here. Gamer. Go back here. I don't think the key is back here, but we get something. We get a card buzzy beetle key. We do or not key. Uh card. So we can do more damage to them. <laughs> that was scary. Oh wait. <laughs> so wait for this to replenish. Hopefully not die to the buzzy beetle shell. Maybe. I'm not gonna deal with that. Then we go over here. And like a gamer. State farm is there. I don't know. Aha. He sure is there. And now I'm trapped in here. Hop on back here. Go quick past the fiery boys. And use the ruins key. And not take damage as well. Up we go. Anything here? There it is. See what happens when you look for the secrets. Yep. Taking damage, of course. Oh wow, a big red button appeared. Rut row. Whatever am I going to do? That's my Wii Remote vibrating. And they all fall down. And magically, I have a platform, but <laughs> there's nothing right there. And magically, they also don't hurt. <laughs> Weird. <laughs> uh. Yeah. So the order is one, two, three, three, four, and then a staircase appears. Man, I wish I had a self-building staircase in my home. Better save. Also, better put new batteries in my Wii Note, but that's beside the point. And now, this is a boss battle. Once I go far enough. Warning. Uh, 
Ah, that's a big dragon me boy. Intrusion detected. Leave immediately or be purged. Wait. Scan initialized. Red cap detected. Blue overalls detected. Level 5 mustache detected. Incredible. Possible subject identification. But it is impossible. Hold your position. Scanning databanks. <laughs> Throw back to the Wii Shop channel. That was a genius little thing to put in there. Search complete. One positive match. System overload. Legendary hero identified. Forgive me, hero. I am called Fractail. My only purpose is to defend the pure heart from lawless intruders. You are late. I have waited thousands of years for your arrival. You may pass. The pure heart is just ahead. Ha ha ha. It won't be that easy. No, no. Who speaks? It's Dementio. He's back. So very nice to meet you. And your mustache. I am Complex Master of Dimensions. The pleaser of crowds. I am Dementio. Remember the name well? I know you. You're in that. It would be so very dull if your journey ended so easily. Instead, it ends with magic. Ah, <laughs> oh, yes, much better. Now you can. You and this robotic guardian can spend some quality time. Yes, quality snack time. When he snacks. On you. For you. For the snack. Ciao. Well, what did he just... Beep. I am error. Press any key to, key to restart. System not found. Insert install disk. This not found. Please... Blah. Errors. You guys can read faster than I can. Way to go, genius. 404 computer hamsters not found. Threat level upgraded to jelly roll one. Detonation imminent. Beep, beep, bull blip. Oh, yes. C drive. Run query identification. Run insult generator. Insults. Go away, yeti lip. <laughs> Control Alt Delete <laughs> Ah yes Uh So this Is like one of the only boss fights That actually Utilizes the 3D Aha uh -huh, I can make him sneak Follows me around wherever I go. Uh, so then... Dodge the boy. Okay. Um... So yeah, I think we just kind of have to dodge everything until he comes through the ground. So he flies off into the distance, and then... Looks like Fractale is charging straight at us. Better watch out. Better watch it. Okay, and then... We hitch the train ride. And then we go... Oh, wait. Do this... Uh, quick. Uh, <laughs> Three hits. Quick, get up the hamster wheel. I got close. Okay. And now we have to do that two more times. 
Such a fun first boss, as they all are. Okay, now he comes toward us. And I'm gonna just kinda double back and not worry about his attacks. Ugh. And we wait for him to fly by. Once we can see his tail. And we flip into 3D because he's gonna come right back. And we hitch a ride. On the, on the magic school bus. As long as we don't get run over by said magic school bus. Uh, uh, come on. I better not run out of time just because I got screwed over and started from the back. Climb the top. Dang. I almost got back on. I think it is possible if you climb up and then kind of double back, you might be able to hitch a second ride. I can't remember, though. If you can, I definitely have not pulled it off. And then he goes across. Once we see his tail, we do the same thing we've already done twice. He comes charging at us, and then we go bop and hitch a ride. That's not what I wanted. System crash. I have malfunctioned. What have I done? Hero, hero, the error is mine. I am sorry. Game circuit, smoldering. Please, you must save our world. It's Fortnite. Save the world, guys. And he becomes a skeleton. <laughs> There's a robotic cataquack. <laughs> I don't know what it's actually called, but whatever. It doesn't matter. Because now we're back to the joyous desert theme. I know we're back in the ruins. Welcome, hero. My name is Merlima. Mer Merlumina. That's her name. Well, I am a dormant soul. I have waited long to give you the pure heart. Yes, I have been waiting for 1500 years as everyone else has. Your presence here must, must mean that all worlds have begun to collapse. Yes, they have. In fact, that's why we're here. Before I give you the pure heart, you and I must speak. Listen well, hero. Long, long ago, my people built a civilization hailed as a beacon of the culture. Sadly, despite our power, there was one thing that we were powerless to stop. The Dark Prognosticus. Nobody knows who authored the dark book. It foretold the events of the future. On the last page, it was written that a chaotic power would devour the world. We knew it had to be stopped. Our greatest minds devised the grand plan to stop the tragedy before it happened. We needed something with the pure essence of love to front confront the chaos. Researchers set to work, and they created the Purity Heart. We divided the Purity Heart into eight pieces and hid them in different dimensions. 
We hid them for their own protection, waiting for the day the hero would arrive. Everything was going as planned, or so it seemed. But the wheels of destiny began to spin wildly out of control. It began with a very small incident. At that time, I was young and quite beautiful. It started the day I met two very fetching young men. And you see, my life set sail toward a maelstorm of love. You see, I asked one out, but however, it was, well, you know, basically it, and then I said, and he said, and then, sleepy time. And that is why we hope the Purity Heart will have all the power, have the power to defeat Chaos. To save all worlds, we must find the eight pure hearts that form the Purity Heart. And that is all I have to say on the matter. And that's all I have to say about that. Or even listening carefully. Uh huh, definitely. Excellent. I didn't tell the short version, so I wasn't sure if you would fully understand. It is up to you to find the pure hearts, for they are our last and only hope. <coughs> Go forth, hero, and save the worlds. We are depending on you. It's Fortnite. Save the world again, guys. Yay. Fancy boys. You got a pure heart. Look at Throw just shaking. End of chapter. Before disappearing, Merlumina had entrusted Mario to save every world. He had waited 1500 years to deliver the message to the legendary hero. With the second pure heart in hand, Mario was in great spirits, but six pure hearts still remained to be found, and the journey had just begun. With a flutter, Tippy said, I think we better return to Flipside. The weight of every world's fate once again rested on Mario's shoulders. Yeah, so I guess the hero went ahead and stomped you and sent you back here. You got to forgive me, Count. I've failed ya. I've never felt less chunky in my life. <laughs> Our hero... So our hero is real, yes, a force to be reckoned with. Nastasia and the Prophecy, consult it and learn where the hero will go next. We will lay de a devious trap for him and bring him to his very knees. Blech. Yeah, um, I already sent Mimi to a site picked for that purpose. This pleases Count Black. Excellent work, Nastasia. I've granted Mimi powers potent enough to ensure that she will obliterate this hero. Yes, we will be helpless against her. I depart. Alert Count Black when this hero is no more. <laughs> Don't forget the book. Yeah, I'll fire off a medal on that, but for now, we have an another item on the agenda. What chunks you got a sec? Yeah, so some minions on the Bowser organization are still resisting assimilation, but I'm heading out to squash the resistance, and while I'm gone, I want you to stay here. Yeah, you just sit tight and think about your recent job performance, okay? He's terrified. Oh, oh god, this really tweaks me chin hairs. <laughs> Oh boy, more content. Was that accurate enough? <laughs> what? How did I end up napping here? Wait, didn't that nasty Count Black try and make me marry Bowser? And then Luigi, he... Luigi! Bowser! Anybody there? Uh, no. You're the only one of the wedding party left standing, it looks like. Is 
So you finally woke up, huh, princess? Oh, you guys. Are you alright? Yeah, but who knows what happened. That was one crazy wedding. We can't even find his groomness. You know, you remember King Bowser? Oh, and that guy with the mustache. I think he had a green tux on or something. Yeah, or uh, Luigi. That's the guy. We don't know where he ended up either. Thing is, most of us minions got all brainwashed by the black guy's assistant. Yeah, everybody's half nuts. It's not safe here. We've got to clear this area. Now. Private Koopa here will escort you, okay? You guys make it, make a break for it. But what are you, what about you? What am I gonna do? I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go help my men. King Bowser would burn me to a crisp if I left him. Leave no Koopa behind. Good luck out there, princess. Hail Bowser. <laughs> Farewell. Okay, lady, we gotta evac this zone. Let's roll. Uh, you give up. There is no hope for escape. All hail the glorious count. Do not resist. Submit to his rule. You will love it. What's this some insubordination, Johnson? I'm your captain. Drop me down and give me 20. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna have to tell you that your orders mean nothing. See... They've already sworn an internal allegiance to Count Black, okay? And now you need... And now you need to. So just go ahead and pencil in you for 10 o'clock brainwashing. You just messed with the wrong Koopa, I serve Bowser. You tell this Count... York! <laughs> hey, old Black. <laughs> yeah. There, isn't that better? So listen, there's still a few problem minions that haven't sworn to allegiance. You be a lamb and round them up. Okay, thanks. Yes, ma'am. Right, right. Oh man, this is going downhill. Did you see that? They even broke the captain. Look, lady, if they find us, it's game over. We've got to clear this area. Stat. Let's go through this door. Where are you going? Sorry if I'm short you with you. I don't want to freak you out, but I'm sort of freaking out. I wrestle down the staircase. Uh, I can't do anything else let's try this one you know what let's check out the other door why not they might both lead to the same place i don't know hold up lady our intel showed a ton of hostels behind that door this route's a no-go we have to find another way out. Okay, fine. Okay. And then we go out here. Right row. No, no, dead end. Well, staying here won't do any good. Let's turn around and keep looking. Oh, turn back? Yeah, no, your friend there had it right. This is, this is your dead end. Who, who are you, anyway? Who are you? Fine cover, lady. I'm trained to handle scum like this. And he goes up to you. Bjort. All hail Count Black. Wow, Princess, you sure are lucky. I thought the wedding explosion finished you. Yeah, but this is the end of the road, and your luck runs out right here. Uh, 
She is P.O.'d. It's time you came on over and got with the program. Come and serve Count Black. Never. Yeah, that's great and all, but my hypno powers kinda say otherwise. Just sit tight a sec, okay? Cause I've got a brainwash. I gotta brainwash you real quick. What? That wasn't on my schedule. Where'd you go? Well, that's not really a deal breaker. A prophecy. <laughs> the our prophecy fulfillment plan is running smoothly. We have no need for her. Yeah, and it doesn't matter where she runs since all worlds are about to fall. I remember that day well. The room was warm. The whole place was at peace. Uh. You're awake at last? Where am I? This is a human's home. Bleach. But, but. Don't wiggle like that. I found you at the cliff base. You took quite a fall. You're a human, correct? I don't repulse you? I am of the tribe of darkness. Why would that matter? Anyone with a heart would not ignore an injured soul. That was the day our paths crossed. That day? That was the day our tragedy was set in motion. Hmm. Well! If you get a pure heart, you can choose to visit specific sections in each, chap each chapter. First to Merlin's place. I did it. Off to Merlin's we go. You returned so soon. I can see from your faces that it went well indeed. Let's head back to my house so you can tell the details. So please step right in. Head back to my house, two feet behind me. So how was it, dear friends? Did you find a pure heart? Yeah, look, it's right here. I have it in my hands. Oh, such pure brilliance. This is a true piece of the one true purity heart. Yes, we Mer Merlimina. You gave it to us. What? what? Lady Merlamina? You were well met. She is an ancestor of mine. She was the one who wrote the right light prognosticus to counteract the Dark One. Merlamina and those who followed her built this town. They are why we are here. M -m -m Master Merlin! B -b -b Bad news! What is it? Get a hold of yourself, lad. Y you see, um, 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 you see, a girl fell out of the sky. What? A girl fell out of the sky? What in the world? Haha, because there are multiple worlds, I get it. I don't know, just please get up on the elevator and come help save her. So it shall be. And you, Mario, come along. We may need your presence as well. Me? I want to le read the light prognosticus. What happens? Follow them. Go get them. They went up above, didn't they? Let's go. Can't access that other area yet. Let's go. Oh. Oh, it's Peach. Who would have guessed? Um, yeah, so I was looking up at the tower and she fell out of nowhere. Hmm, she does not look at all familiar to me. Who could this be? 
Hey, that's my girlfriend. Well, what's the matter? Princess Peach, so is this the so this is the princess that the Count Black kidnapped. <laughs> well that pearl gar girl poor girl seems to have had a rough time. Of that we can be sure. He does not appear to be conscious. He is shivering uncontrollably. What could the problem be? Okay. Maria, you must go to the chef named Saffron on the first floor, flip side. I'm sure she knows a warming and revitalizing recipe for this poor girl. Once she revives, we will be able to ask Princess Peach exactly what happened. Now off with you. Find Saffron the chef on the first floor. This is the third floor, I believe. Oh, here, can I pick up this child? No? Okay. That would have been funny. So now we are on the second floor, and I think we go across to get to the third floor. Yeah. Third floor we go! I think, th yeah, this is the chef place. How do you lady? Welcome to Sweet Smiles. Oh, sugar, our dishes will turn that little frown right upside down. What? A friend of yours is out cold. Oh, mercy! Oh, listen here, sugar. She sounds <laughs> like she needs some spicy soup. All I need is a fire burst to make that pot of soup that'll warm her up in a jiffy. Some store self. Some stores sell fireburst, so check the shelves wherever you can like to shop. You bring me one sugar, and I will... I'll make you some tasty spicy soup. It's a DS. Awaiting data upgrade. Of... Uh, where is the shop? I think... Uh, the shop is up above. Yeah, right here. Good. How's it? How are you? Good. Lucky to find homes that's shopping the flip side. First time here, eh? Uh-huh. Ought to tell you what we offer. We offer shop points here for our regular customers. You earn shop points with every purchase. Limit to one point for every purchase. Earn enough and you win a free gift. Free stuff for free. That's good. Want to know how, just how many points you've saved You've saved up? Just ask me. Got that? You want to hear my spiel again? I got it. What you need? I need to buy. Go ahead and grab the item you want. They're all good. I need the fiery boy. That'll run you 20 coins. Sound good? Oh, so good. Looks like that pushes you up to one shot point. Anything else sound good? Or look good? Appreciate the business. Good. Bye. What a happy lad. Now there's the fire burst I need. Now let's get started on making that spicy soup. Hand me that fire burst. Oh sugar. You want me to create a dish for you with that fire burst? One spicy soup coming right up, sugar. Ooh la la, yum. Put it in your tongue. Sorry about the weight, sugar, but it turned out just right. Spicy soup. 
They're gonna wake up to that sweepy, sleeping beauty of yours, sugar. Hit it to her just as quick as you can. Up we go. Spicy soup. Yes, just put it on top of her. Mm. Oh, it seems to have worked. Mm. I feel like I just ate the most delicious thing. I haven't had a dream about such tasty food in ages. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> oh, Mario, you're okay. But where exactly are we? This is flip side. Yes, because I know exactly where Flipside is. Um, okay. And who are you? My dear, I am called Merlin. And that is known as... And that is what is known as a pixel. Her name is Tippy. Come on, let us adjourn to my house. I would be grateful if you would tell me more there. And then before I knew it, I saw... I woke up and saw Ma I... Welcome inside, Mario, you and Tippy. Well, my dear, that is the most assured, ass, assuredly, uh, that is most assuredly a tale of woe and troubles. Oh, Mario, what do you suppose happened to Luigi and Bowser? They died. No, happened to them, exactly. Thank you, Mario. Hmm, I suppose you're right. There is just no way to know. I just hope they're safe. Merlin, what, what should we do next? And one pure heart shall lead the way to the next. It, so it is written. There are still more, more heart pillars to be found in Flipside, young man. When you find the next heart pillar, you must set a pure heart in it. And when you do so, a door to the world containing the next pure heart will appear. And... My intuition tells me the next door may lead you to the mysterious Merli. Like Vestovius and I, Merli is one of the ancients. We are like long lost cousins. Yes, I have heard that Merli has long guarded an ancient and secret treasure. If my instincts are correct, it may be the next pure heart we seek. I must tell you, the light prognosticus also speaks of her magical powers. So, we just need to find this Lee person and that is it? Oh no, are you going as well? Oh, are we- Are you going as well? You should not tax yourself. I've only- You've only just recovered and it may be dangerous. Well, I can't just sit around here and not- And let everyone else go off and save the worlds now, can I? After all, the void is spreading in the sky. And it's my fault. Mine and Bowser. I'm going and that's final. I've made my decision. Peach has joined your party. You can now control not just Mario, but Princess Peach as well. I guess we need to find that next heart pillar. Hmm, this princess is headstrong, to be sure. How very refreshing. I insist you take this. Old key. There are secrets in this town that not even I know. I do know. What? <laughs> you guys can read better than me. This may be one of the keys to uncovering them. Quite literally, in fact. Please, use this key wherever it fits here in town. My intuition tells me it should be... You should be able to use it very near my house. I will continue to read the light prognosticus and look for any clues that may help. I am sure that musty old tome still has much to teach us. Yes. Much indeed. Now, Mario, Princess Peach, do you all do all you can to stop the Count's evil plans. Let's go, Mario. Come on, Tippy. So 
off we go. And we already know about the parasol. Switch to Mario, just because. Well, there's a key right here, or a key lock, lock key boy thing here. I believe our pillar is right over there. Or no, is it down here? Forget now. I really need to wrap up this episode too. Haha, uh -huh, it's over here. I can see it from here. Because what? Color is pure than white. Alright. Part color ahead. That wasn't supposed to happen. Now, this is actually kind of a tricky jump. Oh. <laughs> See, what we have to do is we have to go all the way back here. Jump up here. Flip to Peach. And hover across. It's a pure heart. That peach definitely worked hard to get. <laughs> and the next door opens. Yay. I did it. Uh, so you can't flip as Peach, so I have to flip back as Mario. And then, it's right here. Take the shortcut to go all the way back. And then, once I find a save block, we're going to finally end this episode at like 50 minutes. Which is way too long. <laughs> back and yes I know that we the battery is low and I'm falling apart my battery is low too <laughs> that's the episode I really want to go sleep now bye guys <laughs>